Welcome back, my name is Brad Piku, the game is Final Fantasy 7 and Rebirth. Last time we did some more world intel here in the Nibel region. We're down to the last four. Here, 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 and here. Uh, I also looked into the uh, affection mechanics. Apparently the only way to see it is to be in town and see the little circles over their heads. I think that's kind of dumb, but... It is what it is. The chocobo is gone. I was here just a second ago. That yellow chocobo that was following me every which way. Curiouser and curiouser. Oh well. So, oops, my finger slipped. Hello? Weird. Says this away for the fiend in Dell. There you are. Dangerous fiends may be in the vicinity. Exercise caution. Rare Cubaldon variant detected. Commencing Guidance Protocol. Note the distinct shape of its upper jaw. That sharp, many-toothed appendage allows it to skewer prey. The Cubaldon then uses its forelegs to bring the impaled meal to its mouth. These voracious omnivores will eat anything they find, including plants, animals, and even corpses of bees. Depending on what they've devoured recently, their appearance and physical capabilities may vary. While individuals do not pose much of a threat, they can be extremely dangerous in large groups. Calling these fiends will help keep the nearby village and farmsteads safe from their appetites. Alright. Wow! What a must! Let's see how this plays out. Let's see what it says has to say. Splitting out the new weakness, which is ice. A rare cool the done variant that resorted to cannibalism after being unable to find any other food. It is extremely aggressive. Not hesitating to attack anything, it uses a potential threat. Where is my health? Stagger. I need a bench. I need to buy more cushions.
I need a lot of things. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. And there's this fiend intel here. Yeah, that yellow chocobo falling on that river was real weird last episode. No, slow down. And it's a sapphire. I really should be doing more crafting. Let's do it now while I'm thinking about it. Miss Giga Potion. Need Phoenix Drafts. Planet Sphere is there. Oh, that's because I'm full up on that. Okay. So 14. Need a base edge or seal armlet. I need more planet spirit. Need kick of potions. Which I can't make because I need more Saint Loose Leaf. Okay. Shroud in blue fire will quench flames and pressure it. While it's not bathed in fire, dodging or guarding the answer of attacks will pressure it. Do your own bridal attacks with non elemental masses. Oh, 
auto weapon ability material improved. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Stellar performance, Cloud. I can't thank you enough for providing such valuable combat intel. I'll use this data to further enhance my guidance functionality. That would be a great misuse of our resources. Requesting attitude adjustment. In any case, I've utilized the data for a new challenge. Feel free to access it via the combat simulator when you have the time. Well, that's certainly going to be my next step after finishing up here in the Nibel region. I'm going to swing by the Moogle house, I guess, and turn my hair out for a bit. It certainly seems to be. Oh, here we go. Please bring back all the mooglets for me, Koopo. There's a tree there. There are trees in the corner. There we go. Can I not hop over? Okay, that's three of five. All right, last one. Oops, did not see that banana. What do you mean? Hello? There we go. Stupid moogles. So much. You're a true hero. Every single emporium is once again open for business, Koopo. It was Mog and Mag's hope that these special shops would bring happiness to folks all throughout the world, Koopo. And that dream lived on, passed down to their children, and their children's children, and so on, for countless generations. One day, these Mooglets will inherit that legacy, like those before them. Oh, be 
before I forget, I have a super duper amazing present for you to thank you for all your help. You're gonna love it. Koopo? Why would you do this thing? Koopo. This is madness. And show our guest how it's done. He's flying. Koopa Paul. Kind of stuff, Moogle. Now that we've been reunited, Moogle we'll Lover Trophy Urn. Continue our efforts to spread joy all over the world. Also, we found a bunch of rare and exotic items you won't want to miss out on. Come see for yourself, Koopo. All right, sure. Thanks what do you got? Coming to our Moogle Emporium. You have elixirs for 15 Moogle medals. Level boost materia. Healing fire empowerment, HP, and Moogle amulet. Increases the power of the ability enemies to drop items when defeated in battle. All right, useful for item grinding. Sharpshooter Ninja Secrets. I want that, obviously. Mm -hmm. There's nothing too, too interesting here. I suppose I'll pick this up then. And get this for if I ever do any item farming. Can't catch me. Complete states to earn a medal. No, thank you. <laughs> All right, now for the final Intel of the region. One final fiend hunt. Delve into the mysteries of their origins. 
I mean, given the kind of things that Hojo gets up to, I wouldn't honestly be surprised. I know you Bring can do this. Take the lead. It's on you. My turn. That's the right. Weak dice, splitting a solid move in this way will pressure it. Easiest pie. Congratulations! You managed to complete all intel objectives. That's the now region complete. What are we doing for time? 20 minutes. I could very easily do a combat challenge or two. You got any choco grass for me? Thanks. If you find any more, I'll be here. Now how about plumes? Six star materials are now available. New Shuffle Bow gear in stock. Buy stuff for kill here. Do, 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 do. I need nothing here. Maybe some planet's mercies. Everything else I've got pretty good supply of. Cosmetite ore. Yeah, that's 10k a pop. Ooh boy. I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it, okay? It'll all pay off in the end. I promise. So say it you. Oh, hello. A level boost. Materia. And a free elixir. Don't mind if I do. It would appear you have completed our survey of the Nebel region, Cloud. One could argue that this is where the Shinra Electric Power Company truly began. Consequently, it's no surprise that your investigations identified a multitude of concerns. Let's hope our partnership leads to lasting solutions. Alright. Comet Materia. Don't mind if I do. MP Absorption. Of course, of course. Dark side material allows you to use dark side. When active, increases the potency of abilities. Causes you to suffer damage when they are used. I see. So it's kind of a little blood knight ability, huh? Let's 
Five that you fail as teammates, ATB gauge when ATB commands are used back to back. Interesting. Now let's use that combo. Kind of I'll probably only have that. <clears throat> I'll probably only do one, two. And polish off the rest. Next episode, but uh, yeah. All right, Odin. Allow me. A noble summon recreated in virtual reality. This knight claims war and death as his domain. On top his faithful steeds, this near, he rides into battle and rends his foes asunder. Many ATB commands evading attacks or collecting detrimental status effects will put Odin on the back foot. Both thrilling and pressuring him. Conversely, taking too many of the sacks will lead him disheartened. Leading him to sound Fragilhorn's warning and unleash his Sentenzuken. See, greater resistance to poison. I was still in the middle of my no weaknesses. Oh dear, how much is this gonna do? Oh, straight nines, even on his weakest form. Okay then. <laughs> Do they know it? Yeesh. Keep it together. I'm hit by that much. What do you mean? Huh? 
Why is it using Zendigoo? Can I dodge everything? Okay. Something is clearly not right here. I apologize for my niece and nephew screaming their heads off if you can hear them. Okay. Hmm. Like, hmm. Deal with that. I hear one stop bomb ring shot. Time to dodge that. Taking over. 
Okay, so first things first, I think I need to de-shell Odin as my very first move, then, then, move on with the rest. Do you have any element to resist? No. with this reprisal spam.
Spatial distortion, I don't like the sound of that. Uh, I think Yuffie is about to perish. Hey, you feel lived. Temporal imprisonment, huh? So, uh, how long is that petrified for? Should I be... Hmm... Okay, good. Aerith is back to normal. Again with the space of distortion. Okay. Order material four star. That was not easy. And it, and it filled out the episode. You've done wonderfully. the unthinkable. 
A single mistake could have spelled certain. You don't say. But your persistence paid off in the end. With his mighty Zontetskin, this master of the blade will certainly help you cut a path to victory. Well, next episode we'll be wrapping up the rest of these uh, missions. Please let me know. I'm always happy to help. I really need to find a bench or some weight to restore HP. But until then, it. remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring the little bell, and if you've been so kind, yeah, so kind, get off my lawn. If you have the casuals.